what's going on here i mean i don't i don't know what's happening here hi guys you are coming with me today because i'm actually doing something for once um i love vlogging but my life is not interesting enough to vlog on the rig you know what i mean like i did a vlog when i went down to london but i didn't even upload it because i started editing it and i was like this is basically just a lot of footage of scenery in london so i literally looked at the footage i had and i was like this sucks anyway i'm filming today because why not i have other content i want to make but not today <laughs> also can you hear that I have taken annual leave today. It's a Friday and I am off. But there's work going on in my building. So it woke me up early. Anyway, we can cry about that another day. I'm going to get something to drink, something to eat. That's the thing that woke me up. So, R.I.P. to me. I'm just having apples, pineapples, peanut butter, and this coffee that's supposed to look aesthetic, but it honestly just looks like, I don't know, kind of gross, but that doesn't matter because it tastes really good, so... <laughs> now we're gonna go ice skating i also realized that when i was like oh i'm bringing you guys along with me exciting i didn't even tell you what we're doing um so yeah we're going ice skating the ice rink is open for booking so i assume that they limit how many people are on the ice at one time which i love because there's nothing worse than a really crowded ice rink underestimate how difficult it is to record and skate because I'm not that good so I'll try to get some footage I've got some like random footage of my brother but it's rough out here
struggling now. like a weird montage in a bowling ring. We went to bowling um, after the ice ring. It was really cool, um, but I, uh, my phone just died. So I have a bad habit of not charging it before I go out. But when I go out, I don't really use it because I'm out unless I feel very uncomfortable and awkward and I want to like not be there. So I'm like on my phone because I don't want anyone to come up and talk to me. I lost, obviously. I don't know if you guys know this about me. I basically have a talent for being the worst at everything. You know how you get those people who are just good at everything? Like literally they just excel at anything. Like even if they haven't tried it before, they are just good, right? Okay, so I am whatever is the opposite of that person. I am just exceptionally bad at everything. Like, it, it's amazing that it's even possible to be that bad at like literally anything that I try. So if you ever see me being like really good at any particular task or project, I have tried so hard, like, which is really difficult because in my family, my family is super athletic. Everyone in my family like kind of values sports and athletics over academics and I was always more of an academic um, and obviously I was like on the swim team on the running team on you know I played netball and all of that kind of stuff but yeah I suck doing uh, sporty stuff is always fun because I really enjoy it but um, I suck it's not just sports that I suck at actually it's probably like it's like a lot of things <laughs> oh it's funny because it's true so I fell during ice skating and then I went to bowling and I lost at bowling. So all in a day's good work. Oh, I, one interesting thing that happened. I ordered from a South African shop. It came today and I'm really excited. Um, I can show you what I got, but you probably don't care. Um, I got like Wilson's toffees. I got Simba chips, ghost pops, flings. Um, I got pre neutro because I actually really miss it. I have that to look forward to today. I am going to watch the rugby, the South Africa versus Lions is playing today. I'm excited to watch that and I'm going to just like chow down on all of my South African sweets that I bought. Okay, that's basically it guys. Um, you just watched like a montage of me getting very aggressive and angry and then very happy during rugby. <sighs> when I watch rugby, I'm a different person. Like it's not normal Alia. Rugby Alia is a totally different human. If I disagree with what the refs ruled and you're sitting next to me and you're supporting the opposite team to me and you like fight against it and you're like, no, well he, sh he did this and your player did that. I protect my players. like. Like that's like family, right? Like I literally get very aggressive and protective. So if you disagree with me and you're like, well, your player did this and your guy jumped here and he, he did a high tackle. I'll be like, well, it's not my fault. Your player is so short. But the thing is, everyone that knows me knows that like what happens in rugby stays in rugby. So if I get really like aggressive and angry at you while we're playing rugby, like while we're watching a rugby game, um, 
I don't mean it. I'm just very uh, passionate. So yeah, this is officially the end of the vlog. Um, I don't know what this vlog is even gonna look like. It's probably gonna look really messy and sporadic and weird, but yeah. Yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.